Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting going to episode two of Wonderful Pretty Curious. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> well, give it. You're very welcome. Well, yeah, because you're a fro a human. <laughs> Hi, Cody. <laughs> no. I know. Cody, why can't you do that? Cody. Yeah. <laughs> huh? Cody. Oh yeah, gotta get that necktie out. You sleepy, baby? You go garden. Okay. Right? There you go. The wonderful pack. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, she's going to become one by the end of the episode. (laughs) 
Yeah, I, I know. Who can believe that? Because she's like, oh my god, I'm an actual girl now, so I can play with my human. <laughs> you're on. Baby, you, no, that's a big no-no. You can't talk to your family about being pretty curious. No one can know that you're pretty curious. Uh-oh. Oh, is it going to make a house? Uh, okay, then. Hold on, she's still a human girl. Wait, go, baby. There you go, cause you were sleepy. Girl. You get up. Why are dogs so cute when they're asleep? Like, oh my god. Like, I mean, they're they're cuter when they're awake, but when they sleep, when they get to dream, it, it's just the most cutest thing in the world. And that's why you gotta be there to protect her. Oh my god! You found her! Somebody must have treated her so bad. But she found a new good owner. That's so good. No. That's some good behind backstory, though. Because I never would have thought it would have been that. And now you're just talking. Now? <laughs> no, you can't not win mom and dad around. Look at her, look at her. Look at her! No! Hush! You can't talk like that. I want the plushie of her so bad. Oh my god. I, I need somebody on Mercari to resell it and let me buy it. Y'all remember the cat, uh, I think, Duchess from the Aristocrats? That's what she gives me. That and Marie vibes, so. No. <laughs> Poor baby, my introvert. Damn, she left so quickly.
seriously. Oh, Cody, I learned something new. I mean, well, you know, Yanni and Kiana were like that, too. But Kiana, Kiana ran. Kiana was a big dog. Even though she was teeny tiny, Kiana thought she was a big dog. And that's what I love about her. Kiana was me. Kiana was a loner. I miss Yanni and Kiana. <laughs> But Cody acts like both of them. Sir, once again, we pray you are our final care of the show. He's so pretty, though, too. Mm-mm. <laughs> All you, like, kind of hear is straight up Anya at, like, some points. No, 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 no. Stop. He's so sweet. Oh, my God. That's an Anya face right there. If only your slash cure Phillies was here to just, like, console her. Oh. Also, just seeing the bunny alert, like... Love that. No, 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 it's nothing. Nothing. Please don't follow her. I love the fact that she just summons it. And then instantly. Human thighed. That means we're going to see the same thing with Yuki and whoever the final cure in her pet is. Not the goose. Geese? Goose. Geese goose. One of them. (laughs) 
I love how animated she is. Like, oh my god. Uh oh. You okay? Moral of the story is never stop a girl and her love for her dog. <laughs> Me and Cody. She looks so pretty with purple. It just, it makes not only her hair pop, but her eyes pop. Like, oh my god. Oh, and it had gold in it too. Ah! <laughs> With the fact that she has, like, the little, um, almost like a little, oh my god, what is it? You know the detective thing on it and stuff? Because she clearly looks like a detective, and it looks so cute. Oh my god, it's like Charlotte Holmes and Watson, and I love it. Even her eyes, oh my god, it's so pretty! Ah! You know, maybe it's an ostrich. That's the one thing I didn't think about either. That's my Anya. That's my family, baby! Ah!
Ah. Oh. Thank goodness. Oh. Ostrich. Oh no! This is what we need, my man. Ostrich, help. Oh, we're actually going to see it? Help clutch my pearls. I didn't think we were going to see this until later on. To be continued. Yeah. 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 Okay. She looks so pretty in her freaking pretty care form. Oh my god. Like, seriously, now I am just, I am begging for the love of everything. I need people to draw my baby Anya in her pretty care outfit for care family. I, I need that. That would make me oh so freaking happy. I need it because it's the same say you. Make me happy and then do one with her and her mom, Yor, and have Yor. Dress as freaking care police, cause that's the same say you too. Let's get it. I need it in my life. How you could do Kana. Have Kana be wonderful. Make me happy. But no, like seriously. But like I said, going still into last week, the transformation still is short, but it's short, sweet, simple, and cute. It's very quick. But at the same time, I am kind of hoping that, like, when we get to Yuki and Yuki's, um, master and stuff, that it's not oh so freaking quickly. It gives me feels, too, because I didn't say what it gave me feels, too. Um, I cannot believe I'm about to compare this. Okay, so, you know the, I think it's a Canadian-based Magical Girl series, not Winx Club, um, and not Totally Spies, because Totally Spies really isn't a Magical Girls Club. Um, I would say Lolly Rock esque. So more or less like the three girls who eventually joined Lolly Rock in like the second half of season two. That's what it really refers to me to, possibly because it is simple, short, simple, quick, quick, and boom. One minute we're here, next minute we're done. I'm gonna rewatch that thing in a moment. But it, it's it's good. I mean, because, like, if we're looking at every other freaking transformation all the way from Futaniwa and stop it in here, every other freaking transformation has been about, like, almost, like, what, 60 seconds or more? And this feels like it's about 20 to 30 seconds. Not to say that there's nothing wrong with that, but it is very colorful. It is out there, uh, especially for Iora. Her, her transformation makes everything pop about her. Her eyes, her hair, everything. And she just looks so good. <laughs> Wonderful, as much as I love hers. And hers is, like, hella good. I mean, for a pink, and I love the fact is, like, what on screen, you have the bows on the end and then the crown in the middle. And those are coming in, like, slowly but surely ensuring, ensuring like, the transformation of it. That is really good onto detail and such. And it does make me wonder, especially when we get into the later aspect of who else is going to all join in this small little group of two as of right now, um, how it's going to look. Because I have to go back and look at the other two. Because, I mean, accessory-wise, hat-wise, they didn't have the same, like, crown thing. Like, hold on. Wait. 
course, like, my mouse is asleep. Um, let me go to the open real quick. Oh, one part. Because, like, okay, friendly and wonderful are wearing, like, very similar to matching hats and such. Okay, these two, um, aka Yuki and, um, her master, Yuki's wearing more of a crown and then, um, her master is wearing more of a top hat. So that is a little different. I thought that they would, because I didn't pay attention to that the first time when I saw, like, the initiative first look of each one. I thought that they would have it matchy matchy and stuff it is still matchy especially with their color dynamic because looking at yuki yuki is very much more of a diamond and such um in her color and because she's giving signature I mean, signature silver and such and then the blue aspect because silver and blue kind of really go together a lot and stuff and that's why like a lot of us have been talking about how gold and possibly once again silver or a certain type of color will possibly pop up with the last two which we are secretly hoping that it's satsuru and his bunny um let me go back to the preview real quick i gotta but no the episode was good transformation still good um saving the ostrich we'll see Oh, it's the gummies. I love the way the garden looks. It gives very much like, I had just finished last week's episode, or the final episode of, um, Butana no, uh, no Liver, aka, um, the story of the man who turned into a pig. That paradise for where the, um, the characters go and such. It looks very much similar to that, but it also kind of gives feels to uh, Healing Goods Paradise and their safe haven and such. It's really pretty. Like, I, I mean, god dang, this is gonna be like top tier. Like, I mean, I feel like every every single season of Pretty Here where we see where the fairies or the animals or just wherever the other people, the other characters come from, it's very interesting and different and stuff because, I mean, that's how, like, I kind of felt with, like, Elle's kingdom and such. I love the fact that it was still a kingdom regardless because at, at first I was thinking, are we going to get, like, modern technology? Is this going to be, like, a different time and stuff? Like, well, cell phones and this. No, but still, it was a very pretty kingdom. But I am kind of also expecting a kingdom in this garden. We might see it. Maybe not now, but possibly later in the future. But I am surprised that three weeks in for this, we're now seeing the sanctuary of Nico's garden. I, like I said, I was expecting that more. This is something that you would really expect, like, at least episode 20 to 25, maybe even by episode 30, initially when the whole group is together. And there is something tells me that we are going to get another moment where the whole group as a whole is going to go there and they're all going to interact and stuff. And that's, you know, when we get down to the nitty gritty of, you know, the true story and such. Because once everybody comes together, we just have so many moments. I am also hoping that, you know, these next couple of weeks before Yuki and her partner come in, we get more, like, cute little moments between um, Komugi and Iroha. I, I love the fact that the backstory with this episode literally focusing on the fact that I was initially thinking, like, she immediately bought the dog. But no! She was homeless. She was hurt and everything. And, you know, typical, you know, when I hate to say, I'm not going to say the actual word, but when dogs get mistreated and such, they're very afraid and um, vicious towards any type of person that walks up to them. And that's the same thing kind of almost with like any animal and such. And that's why you have to be very kind and gentle and loving towards animals. And I love the fact that, you know, Iroha took that initiative to take her to the vet, take care of her, bring her in. And, you know, the initiative, like, let me put my hand out so that you could sniff my hand and be like, I'm not a bad person. I'm friendly. You just need to get to know me. And just like seeing how their relationship blossomed into something really beautiful and that these two really genuinely love each other and care for each other. It's just super freaking adorable and cute and wholesome and stuff. And like I said, I can relate. I have a dog. I've had dogs like all my life. I one, and one cat, one cat <laughs> years ago. Um, but I, I'm more of a dog girl and just seeing any little moment that these two have, I'm just like, yep, 
that that's me and Cody, or that's me getting Kiana and Cody and stuff. And, and it's just sweet. It is it's so freaking wholesome, and I can't. I love it so much. It's only episode two, and I'm like, oh, we hitting, we hitting, we hitting home, and we hitting it good. It's just like healing good with, you know, the fact is, like, Nanoha had freaking asthma, and I was like, dang, I can freaking relate. God dang it, I hate when the show relates to something of personal of mine, but I love it at the same time, too. That's why I love this series so much, but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode two of Wonderful Pretty Care. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday slash Sunday for episode three, but until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye! Thank you.